Hi friends, welcome to my channel. In this video guide tutorial, I will show you how to upgrade your Windows Server 2016 Standard Edition Domain Controller on, on latest version. Windows Server latest version is right now is uh, uh, 2020, right? 22. So I have a domain controller you can see that it's a Windows Server 2016 standard edition and I have a domain controller. It's also a domain controller and I have a different OUs, accounts department, HR, and IT department as well. So I'm going to upgrade this domain controller onto the uh, Server 2022, right? Uh, before doing that, I need to mount the, the ISO of Server 2020 with that particular server so i have as iso as you can see there's a virtualized environment i have using an exi for for demo purpose so as you can see that the, the iso is mounted successfully all you just need is to go into the server right click on the support button and then and then click uh, select the AD prep and plus the the shift button shift button hold the shift button and right click on the right click on this uh, on the uh, on the folder right so all you just need is uh, select AD prep hold the shift button and right click of the the folder then you uh, then you open the command windows here right the command windows is open right so you need to type it first ad prep dot exe slash for best prep this is uh, this is a very important part you need to do the uh, you need to enter the command right so without this you uh, you cannot upgrade the uh, the uh, the, uh, the domain controller right so hit enter and here you need to press the c button right and hit enter It's verifying signature. It takes some time. No issue. It's it's normal. This checking time depending upon your uh, server uh, server specification, right? After the forest command, you need to type the one more command, which is domain prep, right? You need to hit enter here, and now that that's all right you need to exit it and go back to the uh, iso drive and double click on it when you double click on it the pop-up window will appear yeah it's preparing the windows for you your system will restart uh, can restart several times so it's a normal you don't need to worry about so this is uh, for this method you can uh, you can upgrade your server without losing your data you need to click here you need to click change how setup the download updates click on it and you right now you don't need to download the driver right so, so you need to you should need to go with the not now not now option right click on the next button right yeah one more important thing that is you need to enter the serial number of the key right serial number of so server uh, 22 right so I have a serial key I just need to put on it just a minute so I have a serial key 
I will also share this serial key with you. No issue. And uh, copy and paste the serial key on on that particular section, right? So it's calculating the the key and uh, it says that the key is uh, validated. So click on the next button. Here you need to click on the desktop experience, right? You need to be uh, very careful with this option. So click on the next button. Yeah, accept the license. Here you need to very important. This is the very important part. Here you need to keep file settings and app. And if you not select this, and you will know, uh, uh, do not uh, want your uh, the uh, the application, and then you need to go with the nothing. Nothing will uh, clean up your operating system, right? So I I. I don't want to clean up my system, right? I don't want to lose my files, so that's why I will go with the keep files, settings, and apps, right? Click on next button. क्लासेस का सैटरडे संडे का क्या सीन है ये तो सारा वीकेंड और बाकी मेरे से नहीं तो उसने अभी कंप्लेन कर देनी है अगर कई साल तो ले नहीं रहे नहीं वो बड़ी नजर रखता है कहना है कि सर ये तो देखे मैं तो तुम्हें ऐसा कुछ भी Hello, welcome back. Uh, I have paused the video. So, as you can see, that uh, the server has been upgraded. Upgraded. Let me show you the version of the server. Just a minute. It's a first time. That's why it's taking a little bit time. No issue at all. So as you can see that uh, the server, Windows Server 2022 standard edition, it's. So let me show you the the data user. The, So as you can see that accounts department, 
IT department and HR department. So, uh, so, uh, so the data is saved. So only the operating system is upgraded and the rest of the data is saved. So that way you can also upgrade your server. So uh, that's all. Uh, uh, that's all the video. So please like and subscribe my channel. Thank you. Thank you for your uh, support.